Yeah, you don't know what we have. You think you know what we have. You don't know what we have. Everybody gets uptight when a few hunkies get their heads beat. What did they do when we was getting our heads beat? So I don't even want to deal with why they got their heads beat, no damn walker reporting up, what other, whatever else that's going on. I just want to deal with black and black liberation. My scene is picking up my damn gun, and I'm a mother. Have my baby in one hand, my gun in the other, and walking up to some hunky, all hunkies, saying, I'm here to get what's mine. We are men. We are not beasts, and we do not intend to be driven or beaten as such. Black people, Mexican American, any kind of people, begins to learn that the social phenomenon is that, in fact, U.S. racist, decadent, capitalist, imperialist America is a holy state. But our only state exists here, that these pigs 
not doing nothing but protecting the average businessman and the demagogic politicians, protecting the exportation system that they got going. That in fact we are tired of it, we are sick of it, we've been brutalizing black people, we've been murdering and lynching them, black people are tired of it. Vanguard revolution all of a sudden, and it's phenomenally correct also, but we are concerned with that social phenomena, we are concerned with that exploitation, we are concerned with the oppression that black people and all other people in the world who are suffering the same common oppression that we are suffering today. And we are going to have to fight, we're going to have to struggle, we're going to have to struggle relentlessly to bring about some peace, because the people that we're acting for peace, they're a bunch of megalomaniac warmongers, and they don't even understand what peace We've got to fight them, we've got to struggle with them to make them understand what we say, we always say the Black Panther Party that they can do what they want to us. We might not be back, I might be in jail, I might be anywhere. But when I leave, you can feel my said with the last words on my lips that I am a revolutionary. And you're gonna have to keep on saying that. You're gonna have to say that I am a proletarian. I am the people. I am, I am a revolutionary. A the Black Panther Party stand up and stand with revolutionaries and practicing revolutionary acts. They have never let the Black Panther Party standing up and proving through social practice that we're not racist, but proving that they in fact are the real racist. They have never let the Black Panther Party stand that we want some socialistic programs implemented in the black community so we can survive and be free. You can jail revolutionaries, but you can't jail a revolution. In this country, you would just think that white people were God that they had the right to give us our freedom. And so what we had to do was to beg them or to act the way they wanted us to act before they gave us our freedom. We must stop seeking to imitate white society. We must create for ourselves to save our very humanity. You must be able to get the guts to say, we are black, our noses are broad, our lips are fake.